From the moment you pick your civilization, you'll be defining your playstyle because every action contributes to your empire. Every move, building, and relationship made earns you science, culture, faith, or gold. And along with the research you've unlocked, you'll shape your path to victory. So what exactly does victory look like? Let's find out. The first way to win is right there in the name. Declare war and dominate the other civilizations by capturing their capital cities by force. Once you've captured the last capital city, boom, victory is yours. Be careful though, warmongering doesn't make you the most popular leader in the world. If the brutish ways of domination aren't for you, try for something more civilized. <laughs> Recruit history's greatest artists, musicians, writers, and more to create great works in your sieve. Soon you'll attract more tourists than the postcard industry can handle. Keep the tourism train rolling and you'll become the envy of the world. Congrats, you just got a culture victory. Want to spread the adorable word of the Book of Poochins? <laughs> Send your missionaries out on a pilgrimage to Civs next door. Your disciples need to convert half the cities of the world to your religion. If they do, you just scored a religious victory for your cuddly lord and savior. <laughs> for a science victory, you'll need to boldly go where no civilization has gone before by boldly beating everyone else to the final great feats in human engineering. Whoever said science was hard. Whether it's by the sword, song, or sacrament, you'll want to build wonders and specialized districts to boost you along your chosen path to victory. Plus, they really spruce the place up. It's a great, big, wonder-filled world out there, and we've barely scratched the surface. Now it's your turn to dive even deeper, discover the fun that awaits, and lead your empire to greatness. Welcome to Civilization 6.